In this video, we're going to take a look at the new pan feature that was just added to Midjourney. The pan feature allows us to expand the canvas in any direction that we choose and fills the new piece with a sample of the original using Generative Fill AI. We'll start here by creating a new Imagine prompt. Type forward slash Imagine and then give it any image prompt. We'll keep it simple and say a forest full of trees midday. Run that and we'll see what we get. Now to use the pan feature, you first have to upscale an image. So let's go ahead and do that. Find the image that you want to upscale and then choose it from below. So if you liked the second one here, we would select U2. Once that upscale comes back, we'll now see the pan options. With the initial pan, you can go in any direction. If you want the image to be more landscape, you could pan left or right or portrait up and down. You can also pan as many times as you want, expanding the image even further. But once you do start panning, you have to keep in that axis. So if you pan left, after that, you can only pan left or right on the image in the future. So let's go ahead and pan this image to the right. Choose the pan right arrow here, and Midjourney will then generate four new variations, this time with the additional canvas expanded to the right. You can then continue this by doing the same process, choosing an image to upscale, and once that comes back, just choosing the pan option again to keep expanding the image out. The pan feature also supports remix mode. So if you're panning and you're expanding your image, but you wanna add something to it, you can do that too. To turn on remix mode, type in the message bar, forward slash prefer remix. Hit enter twice and you'll see the remix mode will be turned on. Now that we have remix on, choose one of the images to upscale. And this time when you choose the pan option, you'll get a pan with a new prompt window. At the end of your original prompt, add what you'd like to include on the new generation. We'll say a deer looking around. Now submit that prompt and you'll get the new variations, but this time with the addition that we just added. And to turn off remix mode if you're finished, just type forward slash prefer remix again, send that and it'll turn it off. Midjourney has said that after a number of pans, your image may be too large for Discord to display. So when it does reach that point, you'll get a link to the image to view on a web browser instead. And that's how you use the new pan feature inside of Midjourney.